CapCut has been the king of free video editors for quite a while, but guess what? This year, it's facing some tough competition. Hey, Arthur here. Welcome to Movavi Vlog, and you should stick around till the end of this video because I'm about to reveal serious new challenger that could totally change your editing game. CapCut started off strong, no doubt, but lately, it's hitting some limits. On the other hand, there is Movavi Video Editor. Comes loaded with more advanced tools for real deal editing, yet it keeps things nice and simple, so you don't have to wrestle with a steep learning curve. I will lay it all out for you right now, so let's dive in. First, let's Let's talk about the interface and how easy or not it is to work with. Now, CapCut looks super straightforward on the surface, but in a weird twist, that actually makes it harder to handle once you start stacking multiple video or audio tracks. Meanwhile, with Movavi Video Editor, it's all much simpler. You just head over to movavi.com, download the program, and you're good to go. You can try out all the features in the free version right away. The interface is super intuitive, no advanced degree needed, yet it's not so basic that it holds you back. You can easily manage multiple tracks, customize text however you want, and basically take on more serious projects without burning out your brain. Once you fall in love with it, and you probably will, you can upgrade to the full version. But here's a tip, don't rush into buying right away. We hand out some awesome promo codes pretty often here on the channel. Definitely give it a test drive. I've left the link in the description below. Now on to automatic subtitles and speed recognition. CapCut can technically generate subtitles, but if you're not subscribed, you're kind of stuck. The subtitle style options are also pretty limited, so it's not super flexible there. This is where Movavi really stands out. It's got these built-in AI tools that recognize speech with high accuracy. Imagine you are hanging out with friends in a cozy coffee shop. There is noise everywhere, chatting, the espresso machine, background music, basically the perfect storm for middle and audio. If you want your viewers to catch every single word, subtitles are a must. In Movavi Video Editor, you just click a button and boom, you've got spot on captions for everything you said. Then you can switch up the fonts, colors, add effects, whatever you need to make the captions pop and match your video's vibe. Don't let all that noise drown out your words. And if you're curious about the details, we made an entire video on how to handle subtitles with Movavi Video Editor. So check it out in the channel in the description below. Third up, let's talk about effects and animations. CapCut does offer built-in effects, which is great, but they are pretty limited. If you're aiming to become a pro-level video creator, you'll likely outgrow those basic tools after just a few projects. Plus, most of CapCut's effects don't really let you tweak all the settings to your liking. Movavi Video Editor, on the other hand, has a wider range of effects that you can customize with layering. Imagine you are in the middle of editing and you want a slick custom transition. Just pop over to the transitions menu where you'll find tons of cool options. Pick one you like, then drag it right onto the timeline between two clips. Want to make that transition really stand out? Before we move on to the Fourth point, I've got a little treat for everyone who stuck around this long. If you grab a one month subscription, you'll score seven days of free access to Movavi Effects, an epic collection of over 6,000 effects and more than 1,500 music tracks. Talk about taking your videos from pretty good to absolutely binge worthy. We're talking vibrant stickers, awesome transitions, stylish overlays, and the perfect music for any mood. And it's all super easy to use, just drag and drop to bring any effect into to your video. So if you're hungry for a massive library of assets to spice up your project, definitely check that out. So moving on to our fourth point, working with text and titles. In CapCut, you'll probably bump into some limitations, not many text effects, no manual animation tweaks, and it's a bit clunky when it comes to multi-line text. Meanwhile, Movavi Video Editor gives you super flexible setup for titles, complete with built-in templates and tons of text effects you can easily customize. For instance, how about cinematic titles that fade in smoothly with just the right touch of shadow? Check out the titles section in Movavi, you'll see a bunch of templates, just grab one, drop it on your timeline, and then fine tune it by right clicking. This kind of text animation can take your edits from meh to whoa, and it's awesome for grabbing viewers' attention. No more boring static text that just sits there on the screen. Color correction and image adjustments. This is our fifth point. When it comes to advanced color editing, CapCut's tools are pretty minimal. Think just enough to get by. Hop into the effects library in Movavi Video Editor and pick a filter that matches the vibe you're going for. Drag it onto your clip and watch 
watch as it instantly brightens those soft pastel tones and brings a crisp, clean feel to the image. You can tweak the brightness to highlight those golden sun rays or boost the contrast to make details. Your footage feels more alive, like it's practically breathing. Feel free to experiment with different combinations until you land on the perfect one for your story. In CapCut, there really aren't a true multi-layer environment. That might not sound like a big deal at first, but can become a total headache once you start working on more complex projects. For instance, if you delete a clip on one track, your upper tracks might shift and mess up your entire edit, causing you to lose important elements or perfectly timed moments you've already synced. With Movavi, it's a whole different ballgame. Start by adding your main video, camera one, with the dialogue to the first track on your timeline. If you have a second camera angle or some B-roll footage, place that on a track above. If you're limited to one camera, you can still benefit from multi-track when adding overlays, text, or extra audio. For the titles, jump into the titles library, pick a cool font, and drag it onto another layer. Label your characters or display a fun fact. You can easily tweak the timing to match the dialogue. Feeling fancy? Go for an overlay clip with with reduced opacity, maybe a vintage camera filter or a light flare effect to boost that cinematic vibe. Picture how your final scene comes together. Emotionally charged dialogue, titles that smoothly appear and disappear, plus a well-placed effect to make everything pop. The question to ask yourself is, how can I elevate the scene's impact? The possibilities are endless once you have the freedom of real multi-track editing. Video editing is an art form, and Mobile Video Editor gives you a complete tool toolbox to explore your creative potential. Jump in, experiment, and create mesmerizing videos that truly leave the mark. Finally, let's talk about performance, especially when you're working on bigger projects. CapCut is okay for quick, simple edits, but it wasn't really built for large-scale productions. It doesn't support proxy files for 4K footage, and users often report glitches and lag. That's exactly why Mobile Video Editor shines if you're dealing with heavier workloads. It handles big projects smoothly, so you can stay focused on the fun stuff. Picture yourself working on a 4K travel edit for example, in Mobile Video Editor, everything's split, whereas CapCut might freeze or slow to crawl. On top of that, CapCut doesn't offer as many advanced tools. CapCut is decent for super simple, casual editing, especially if you need something quick. Mobile Video Editor, on the other hand, is packed with tools to handle real projects from snappy transitions and multi-track editing to AI-powered subtitle generation, solid color correction. Best of all, the interface stays user-friendly, so you don't have to slog through hours of tutorials just to feel comfortable. But don't take my word for it, why not see for yourself? Hit the link in the description to download Mobile Video Editor right now and give it a spin. That's all I've got for today, thanks for sticking around and I will catch you in the next video. Take care! and happy editing.